Alrighty, alrighty, alrighty. Here we are. Hello. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Sorry, can you can you give me a quick ah please? Okay, I have to turn you up. Good. Um, all right, welcome on in, guys, to episode sixty-two of Rune. Oh, yeah. hey. We haven't had. I'm gonna lag. You're not gonna lag. Everything's gonna be fine. You're, we're gonna we're gonna have an amazing episode today. One of our players is gonna be late, which is uh, precisely the player that has an art rework revealed today. Uh, which is a uh, very very oh. interesting timing But he will be here at 11 which means in 30 minutes uh, Either way, I hope everyone is doing fine in chat and thank you very much for for uh, you know hanging out with us uh, You might have noticed a few different things first of all we now have character portraits next to uh, The players beautiful faces so that you guys can see the faces of the characters a little bit better um this way that, that you know it makes it it makes it cooler i think um also as i said before we uh move on to the episode we have thorbjorn's reworked art done by xenovice oh my god ready to be revealed so i'm gonna i'm gonna go ahead and say that this is pretty cool it is are you going to show on uh roll 20 I can do that, yes. Please but do. Yes. I don't... I, okay. <laughs> I can do that. Uh, I will do that as soon as I can. But, first I need to, sh I need to show the boys on stream. Um, so, guys, I have been talking to Xenovice for a while about Thorbjorn, and she's been working on him for a while. Uh, Thorbjorn, as you know, went through a lot, uh, you know, mentally, physically, uh, he's been, uh, he's been killed. Uh, he's been revived, he's angry, he's mad, and he's mean. Um, and he's been having some anger issues. And there's been this, um, this monster that has been showing up behind him when he fights. Um, so I talked to Zenny, and I kind of gave her a few loose points on what to do with him. But the monster behind him, the incarnation of anger, was something that came straight out of her noodle. So... Um, it looks pretty sick. It looks pretty cool, uh, as well as the new spear. Uh, the spear of Shojin, as you guys know, has been changed, um, and it is now the spear of raging uh -huh. shadow. Yeah, and so it's completely different as well. All right, <clears throat> I believe it is time to show him. So, for everyone in chat, in three. Two. It's gonna cover my face. I know you guys like me, but this is better. Oh my god, okay. One. Bam. There it is. The new Thorbjorn, along with the incarnation of anger. I am going to show you guys on, on Roll20 as well, because it's, you know, because why Wait, not? I'm opening this tree. You, you don't even have to. Oh. Yeah, open. Yeah, show me on on room. I I, I think I, I think I already did. I think I already did. Uh, no. I can see it. You no. can see it? Okay, wait. I can see it either. No. I'll fix it. I'll fix it. I'll fix it. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. There we go. And now, boom. Okay. There okay, so we go. Now. Wait, that... I thought it was like a puppy. I'm sad now. It's not a puppy at all. That is the incarnation of that is the incarnation of uh, of anger. Zenovice Zeniv did that. The spear is completely different, uh, as you guys can see. From from green, it went to, to to dark red to blood red, which is now the color of the spear, like the raging shadow. Yeah, that is that is a dragon holding or biting this the Whoa. the spear, and the spear is kind of like the flame that the dragon is spitting. Yeah, it looks it looks fucking oh, sick. Damn. Yeah, it looks pretty sick. Um, Someone's been hitting the gym. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. Thorbjorn's uh, a lot, a lot bigger on the muscle side. Um, but yeah, aside, aside from uh, from his face here, we now also have his portrait there. So uh, obviously, Born is not in here, but whenever he is, he's gonna be joined by the face of his character. Um, uh, but yeah, there we go. That is 
the new rework of Thorbjorn. So we have our new boy. Are those okay. dust bracers? Those bracers? Yeah. No, no, no. That is, that is the... Uh, oh, it's the, a bracelet, right? We're yeah. Bracelet. It's the bracers of armor. Uh, or bracers of defense, actually. It's what gives him the AC. Uh, the bracelet is not there. Nor, uh, nor, nor is the ring. Nor is the ring. Ah, uh, just everything. <laughs> no, that, that's the that's the item that he has that increases his armor class. Um, so yeah, well, I have no more announcements, nothing else to to say. Um, I believe it's time for us to you know roll out the thing. The thing. Yeah. The yep. one that comes in and comes out. The one that is used as the coming in and the coming out. Oh. And begin. I like the thing. This next episode of Rune. All right, so <clears throat> we're back. I noticed that uh, Eclipse's name is missing for some reason. Um, nice. Oh, I know, I know why it's missing. It's in the front? Of uh, I know why it's missing. Boom, it's no longer missing. Um, all right, so. <clears throat> <laughs> um, please watch for volumes and watch together. All right. I forgot to watch together. Oh, if you, if you don't want to put it on, because you might oh, lag. Oh, yeah. You might have a. But just listen well, to something on Spotify. Try. Yeah, I'll try. And if it starts lagging, you guys let like me know. Like no. Okay, yeah. I, because I can yeah. give you, I can give you a playlist if you want. Okay. For you to listen to, to on Spotify or something. It's right there. Either way, let us uh. Oops. Let us get right into the world of Rune with a quick little recap of what happened on last episode, shall we? It's been a long time. So, last episode told the tale of how our heroes acquired one of the legendary javelins that were used to seal Doomral the first time he was freed. It began with them entering the Shojin Monastery and meeting with some of the masters, including Grandmaster Zunan. The monks are training and preparing to aid in whatever is needed for the upcoming fight against the Shadow Dragon. Thanks to Master Dai Huang, the BDC even learned what some of the spears were capable of doing, from stopping Doomral's ability to fly to even neutralizing his breath weapon. After a bit of conversation, they headed into the artifact room, closing the gate behind them as the room is to be sealed at all times as to avoid any of the creatures spawning from the paranoia to ever get inside. Entering the room, they were accompanied by a few monks who were to serve as guards and guides to what was inside, but suddenly blades stabbed some of the heroes in the back. Those very same monks happened to be masked assassins who were ready to ambush the group. 
A fight began, with the assassins ravaging Lady Zun, who died despite the BDC's efforts and almost murdering a few more of the party, as their initial attacks marked our heroes with strange shadow magic that would detonate at a certain moment. Eventually, they eliminated the threat and quickly ran to their dead friend to attempt to revive her. Ryder began the ritual to pull her soul back to her body as the group looked to help in any way they could. Even Argath offered his help, but Sade refused it, being too afraid of what the consequences could be. The ritual succeeded and Lady Zune was brought back, still hurting, but breathing, and Thorbjorn now had the chance to grab the artifact. As he approached it, the item tested his will, and for a moment, it faltered. However, Rido was immediately behind, and understood what was happening, and calling upon the power of the stars, he changed the monk's fate, and the artifact was now in their possession. Now hurt, battered, bruised, and with a friend pulled from death, the BDC must still gather two more artifacts to weaken Doomral, or they can face him without them. Which path will they take? How will they defend Ionia from its greatest threat? All right. So, we pick up pick up pretty much where we left off. Thorbjorn had just grabbed the artifact. I'm I'm gonna be Thorbjorn, by the way. Thorbjorn had just grabbed the artifact. I want to see this. And it, he has it in his hand. And he he turns to you, Brido, and holding the spear or the javelin he goes I'm a little bitch <laughs> I know right <laughs> you had to you fucking had to I would not miss that chance I, love uh, it. <laughs> I would not miss that chance um, so uh, he, he holds the spear with him and uh, or the javelin and and as he does he just kind of stares into your eyes right and he goes thank you gee i know it was you i'm here for that so well we have to deal with whatever it is that is at the gate yeah uh we saw some kind of uh, dome, right? Yeah, you saw a scroll at the gate, and whenever you entered a certain range near the those doors, me. you couldn't hear yourself talk. Mm -hmm. uh, how, how how far was the um, threshold? From uh, the, um... It was about thirty feet. Okay. From the was from there the gate. Something written on the scroll. Roll perception check. See if you can see it from from that distance, from the thirty feet. So it's a pretty small scroll. It's about like this size. You can move. You can move inside to see it as well. Perception. Um, perception, yeah. Perception. Uh, you see some Ionian runes on it. Can I read them? No. no. I mean, like, understand them. Like, you cannot. Not speak. No. no. Um, you can tell me to go see it. It's okay. Uh, I can just dispel it. Are you going to dispel okay. magic? Yeah, I'm going to. All right, uh, uh, roll a wisdom check for me, please, then. Okay. Do, 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 do. Ugh. 12. Um, let's see. Give me a oh, second. Oh, you're gonna take damage. <laughs> Let me process. Yeah. You hold out your hand focus on the radiant magic towards that area and as you cast the spell you feel your magic your radiance begin to grab onto this arcane um effect that is on the scroll and it, you almost manage to pull it out as you see them the both magics fighting each other but it fails in the last moment that was pretty close do i see it I can. Um. yeah I can go there and touch it physically, right? Yeah, you can. You just can't talk in, inside. Dangerous, no? Can I... 
Can I use comprehend language you? on it? Wait, wait, you wanna go close and read it? Yes! It's, it, it just says silence. Does that have to scroll? Yeah. Okay, I move back. And I say, it says silence. Okay. Right, do you think if I somehow destroy the scroll, the effect would go away? I don't know, you're the one that deals with scrolls. Roll an arcana check. Me Eclipse. or Eclipse. Eclipse. Okay, yeah. Mm. While they're doing this, the, is there any shadows in the room? Damn, I need No, uh, yes, if you would destroy the scroll, it will go away. There were more artifacts here, right? There are four more artifacts inside the room on four altars, yes. Do you want to go inspect what they are while Eclipse goes into destroy Didn't the... did we do that already? No. Yeah. We just I want to got... have a quick look. All right. And I, I guess the ones on the right or something. All right. So you find uh, on the, the Jade Altar floating inside of this sort of magical sphere, a pair of boots. They have this sort of... Um, it, what seems to be... They're, they're like scaled scaled boots that are um it, it almost looks like a s serpent scales that that make up the um, make up the the boots and they have these sort of little um little pieces of membrane that come outside of the heels uh then on another one you find a ring um, um yeah i, I just want to take lady zone with me and okay. keep asking her if she recognize any any kind of uh, artifact because okay. she um, might i don't know gotcha uh l let me just c continue on yeah, the, sure, there's sure. uh an, a ring that you find it's uh you can't really quite make out the detail but it, it is a uh sort of dark brass ring uh you find a staff a floating staff uh that has uh a jade serpent that circles around the wood of the staff uh, and culminates on what it seems to be like a dragon a dragon head a dragon head uh, on top and then you also find an amulet a jade amulet uh, that seems to have the the, the symbol of the cho the shojin the mountain with uh, the serpent floating uh, around it so these are the four things you find. And as you take Lady Zun with you, uh, she goes, um, I'm, I'm sorry, I, I don't know any of these and I can't tell you right now, I'm out of magic and also yeah, half it's okay, dead. it's okay. <laughs> yeah, I know, I saved you. You also put me in this situation. No, you wanted to come here. No, you brought me here, I wanted to stay. No, you in the asked for permission I, to come inside because you're very curious and I, I wanted to stay at the Navori at the Placidian and you made me come here am I hearing this? we made a no. deal so you're ah, not, you're, you're, not you're, you're not hearing this either this is between Brido oh, and okay. and Lady Zen come on we didn't made you come we had a deal you do you want yes do you want it. your armor back and le will you let me leave if I give it back to you? I will let you live anywhere any kind of circumstance with Good. or without the armor. All right, then I'm That's leaving as soon as I no! possibly can. No. I will leave. Dude, I will stay here for the me? night and then I will leave. I am trying to talk to Brido here. Said, let me talk to him, please. As you were saying, I will stay here for the night then, Brido, and I will leave tomorrow back to the Placidium. I'm sorry, but I can't risk my life anymore. We need you. We don't... We don't have any other solution right now. You... You and do. You can just we are walk. Taking, it's gonna take days to get to the... to the spear. Brido... Do you think you, you're going I, to survive with days with a dragon like that yes i will the placidium is protecting the not. people the I placidium can, take... can protect people as long as he can protect people you are a target brido i am not i, I am not a target 
I am not their be. target. I am just a... I'm just a seller. I just sell things. I'm an enchanter. I am not their target. They are specifically chasing you and you're making me go with you. <sighs> and she just leaves and walks Wait. back towards the... What? Can't you even make some kind of scrolls or something that would help? That takes days to make. How many days? Three? Maybe at the condition I'm in? It's really strong magic. It literally knocks me unconscious using it at this time. I know, but maybe we can get an agreement and if you do that for us, maybe we can just leave you here, you do it, we go and we come back, and Brido. you don't have to go with us. Brido, I am... I am out of tricks. Three days is... four days maybe is what you would take to get to Rollin, and to get to we the island. We'll need more to go and come back. I... I... I'm sorry, Brido. I really am. I almost... I died! I, you brought me back, but I died. And it I can do it. It changes your perspective. I'm not... I am not a cleric. I am not a faith. I can't trust just because. I am a woman of science. Of study. And I know I can trust myself. And you told me you wouldn't let me die. And you did. I didn't. No, I, I died. You just brought me back, but you didn't let here. me die. Dying is going and not come back. Your spell specifically revives people, Brido. I was dead. I am not doing this again. And she I'm going moves. to need to harm her back, though. If we are going to do this. She snaps her fingers. Nothing happens. I can't give it we to you now. We can try tomorrow. And she continues on and moves back towards I'm the group. sorry. No, I am. And continues walking forward. Alright, whilst you guys are doing this, how are you destroying the... Um... I'm not doing anything. No, before as, destroying as, it, I wanted, I wanted to ask if the scroll is open on the floor. Yeah, it's open on the floor. Can I close it and see if that solves it? 100%, you close it. Does it solve it? What do you do to see if it solves it? I scream to say, can you hear me? Uh, no, okay. Can I hear him? Nope. You just you just see him like talk to you. I want to cut a bit of my blood and okay. drop it. Okay. Drop a little bit of the, your blood. It's on the paper. Ah, uh, can I just rip it apart then? You rip it apart and you feel. <sighs> something sort of like a warm air blow through you can you hear me say it she can I is can. it day or night by the way it is morning it's morning okay all right problem okay, one problem fixed <laughs> yeah <clears throat> thorbjorn meanwhile has been like He's sort of zoom, by the way near me no, she is, she is walking, uh, it, while you're doing this, she is now walking back. Uh, Thorbjorn, as approached you, said... What? Yeah. And he goes, Did you find anything on the bodies? Nothing. Freaking useless. It's just the mask. Or something. Sorry. Alright. Yeah, useless. Well, we should probably get out then. All right, are you, are, you, are you okay? I don't know. I don't have more potions. Yeah, that might be a problem. That was a good one. Thanks for giving it. Wait. It was useful. A team's and a team. And look at Bridal. 
Brido's walking back, back now, slowly. <laughs> yeah. Do I see something weird? Like, I mean, you see them walk separately now. You see Lady Zune come in first, and then Brido comes in after. She look off. Yeah, she died. Yeah. <laughs> as off as it would look. Yeah. Um, yeah, I'll just move closer to right. Oh, no. We have a problem, and mm. I think we have to respect it. We have what? Do we? Yeah, we <laughs> lost our teleportation mode. Why? Well, maybe because she died, or maybe because she doesn't like me. I'm still figuring it out, but I, I think it's the too, first so. one. Yeah, but we believe in something that she doesn't. As you say this, Torbjorn kind of steps up and... I'll be honest with you, I've died a few times. I've woken up in different places after being knocked unconscious. That's not... It's very st stressful for me. So I can only imagine what it might have been for her. Should I... For well, someone that Something? comes from science, it's too hard to understand and she's... I think we should respect her. She will give the armor back, so we will not lose our deal. I don't um... get her point. Like, we need she believes in science, like, so what? We need to get another way to teleport. Can we can ask it? for scrolls or something that... There must be someone that has that power. Can't I just we need to try convince to make her. her help her again? Yeah. Well, uh, how do you want to do that, Sade? Can she hear us? Depends on where you're talking. She right now is just at the gate waiting for you and looking at you. We stayed, we stayed behind, probably. Okay. Oh, yeah. You can go, but... She can tell me. By, by the way, just a, a quick thing. She's like... You can see that although she is looking at you, she's not really... Her mind is not present. Bye, and, need, and neither is Sade. <laughs> um... <laughs> this is a day and a half today, oh, huh? Oh, God. Um, <laughs> but you can see, you can see, we will have Sade back with us shortly, yeah. guys. Uh, don't worry about it. Here she is. There she is. Perfectly back. Um, sure. But, um, as I was saying, yeah, uh, she is, doesn't seem to be mentally present right I now. I would say, if you want to try... Try tomorrow. Okay. Let her rest and think about what just happened. I don't. I, and Torbjorn goes. I don't know if Said meant meant it as talking to her, and maybe more of using Argath this time. can try to talk with Lady Zoom in the morning and try to calm her and convince her. We have a demon on our side, guys. So what? A demon that is capable of controlling minds? We're still we don't need to control a mind, we need someone. to make her believe. If we control her mind, she can teleport us in the morning. And in the end, she will realize we controlled her and it would be worse. That just doesn't we would have, sound right. We would have teleported anyway. Aren't we on solution-seeking mode right now? There okay, must be another one. Smart, besides fooling someone hmm. just for our... I understand what you mean, but... This is do or die, Brido. Both you and I know that. Sade's a weapon, and we haven't been using it. A loading weapon, but a weapon nonetheless. No, we can't. We can't. Can you can can you hear us? <clears throat> All right, no, I guess not. 
Oh, no, she yeah. can. She can. All right. Let's see. So, okay. No, no, no. Oh. She's, she's just relogging, oh, guys. She... I'm for, Forgive us. We're, we're figuring <laughs> things out. Figuring things out. Um, but yeah, he says he, he says that to you, Brido, specifically. I don't know. I want to go talk to Lady Zoom. You? Right now? Wait. Yeah, right now. Wait? Why wait? It, it will not help. Said is the one that can Hello? change her mind. Hello! Hello. Hello. Welcome I don't back. Control her yet. I want to persuade her first. Make her believe my, our cause. We, we, make we can see your camera. Stronger. Yeah, because it's on, but it's It's fine. I didn't get you, Bredo. Oh, I... Uh... Um, I was saying that that might get her memory to be stronger when she tries to resist to say it. I heard half of it, so I'll yellow with it. Um, so the plan is, like, if you explain to me what happened, how long has it been, DM? Uh, since what? The discussion, basically. Oh, and the fight. And the fight. There's been a couple minutes. Uh, at this point, probably like 10 okay. minutes, 15 minutes. Fuck, I need to understand. Anyway. Um, we change your conversation, you know. Wait. Uh, you don't need so? to change my conversation. You just wait. But said, can can't you just control her mind? Yeah. You can just change. Even if it's for what, what one, happened inside. One second, two seconds. If you can make her. I can make her TPS. Yes, if that's the question. But she's out that's of mojo. Enough. You the thing is, her. we can only do that once she is 100% uh, rested. Yeah. And if she is rested, she will feel the, the spell coming at her. Depends That's on... why I was suggesting the, the, the memory change. Wait, but yeah. I can just flash my abs at her, she'll be distracted, and you do it behind. Yes, yes. Yeah, that's how we're talking. Yeah. Um, <laughs> good to have you back, though. Uh... <laughs> yeah, you can just change the the fact that she died, and I have a dog barking, yeah. so it's okay. But I can only change. That was that's why I asked the plan. You can only change ten minutes, so. Yeah, ten minutes is more than enough. Correct. For the no, because and... I would need to change the fight, the fight memory. Exactly. Imagine she would only be unconscious, not dead. Plus your conversation where you openly say she died and she openly says she dies. So it'd be three times, three things away and in different moments that exceed the 10 minutes so i cannot at this moment as you guys are talking she goes um are we getting out weren't you scared <laughs> just one second <laughs> what do we do about this guys you can change the way that she felt after she's become became Alive and it modifies a just... memory, it does not modify how you feel. A feeling, yeah. Mm. Okay, I understand that the control might be the best, but I 100% believe she's very powerful and you know, she will. If it works, cool, but if it doesn't work, it will be... If it doesn't worse. work, I will point my blade at her stop, throat. Stop, stop, stop. <laughs> That's not necessary. Yeah. It's not necessary? Away. There's a giant dragon killing my people. Can yeah, our people. Listen. We don't need or to rest. did you forgot that we all... We are all from here. Then... It seems that you have been the ones that forgotten because you're here talking for time and time and not making any decision. Decision. We try the memory. 
because we will need to rest so I can do that today and tomorrow if we need we try to force the TP because we don't have any other chance so at least we try something if you don't change the memory will she notice oh, if you probably. fail I never tried but she's too weak probably to even notice it maybe let's not underestimate this person you're not this smart shut the fuck up what do you mean? I just don't know how to read. That's literally it. Um... I just had another way, probably. We can just change one part today and the other part tomorrow. tomorrow. You can change the conversation that I just had with her today. And tomorrow we change the... The, the dying part. The death, yeah. She will never know. We will have to control her because if someone talks sure, to her sense. about death part, that might be bad. It's a way. So is this our decision then? I, I mean, I vote yes. They know, but I don't know. They probably will know because it's a spell, so she will sense something if I fail it. So, if yeah. you fail, yeah, she, read the she will her. sense it. The thing sure. is, she's probably exhausted, so that should help. One thing, you need to make very clear what, what you want me to change. Because otherwise it'll be a mess, and you're the only one that can tell me the conversation. So I have all the details. I will go talk to her now. And you see Thorgorn begin to move towards her. No, that's not what we are talking about. Don't... What? Oh god, this fucking guy. <laughs> he moved. He's, t he's now engaged in conversation with Lady Zen. Okay, we just... You can just tell her that I talked to to her. I said I, I was sorry for bringing her here and that I would do my best to keep her secure. You just have to avoid the death part. Just so it goes, even with uh, the part that she didn't die. That's the okay. second part. Yeah. Alright, so yeah, what are you guys doing? Yeah. And do I understand if this information is enough? Is you don't have to try to see? YOLO! Alright. Um, Roll the so, dice, you know? DD. Yeah, yeah. Just, uh, I want to take the opportunity since. Torbjorn is talking with her about something. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I want to use like the extra. Uh, she's been distracted. <laughs> kind of mood. Uh, but yeah, that's it. All right. So, so you're, are you going to do modify memory on her? Modify memory. All right. So that is a what save? Can you tell me, please? Wisdom save fifteen. Um, All right. I'm going to cast guide as she's casting. That that spell. will that will not help though. Oh um, yeah, because it's a save. Yeah, never mind. It's a, I'm saving. Uh, you want to cast yeah. guidance on Lady Zoo? You just see Brido suddenly turns. <laughs> All right, let me go grab her a sheet, please. One second. All right, wisdom save. Please roll bad. All right. So. What are you doing to change her memory? All right. So, with information uh, that I have and knowing that they were talking while looking at things, going on a walk, I want to modify her memory so that a full conversation while talking about the items, mm -hmm. uh, I, I will keep whatever information they shared about the items between them. Uh, but. A anything related to the fight will be switched to Bridal saying he's sorry um, for the danger, but that he kept her safe. We kept her safe. Mm -hmm. And um, her parts, if she mentioned dying or anything, or being uh, scared or against her will or um, unhappy, change that to uh feeling unease but i don't know if this is possible 
seeing truth in what Bridal is saying. Oh, right. Gotcha. So. Of protecting her and not letting her. You. The army. You extend your hand and your what? eyes begin to, to sort of gather shadows around them as the shadows then shift towards your hand and you blow this sort of darkness kiss towards Lady Zoom. And <laughs> as, you, <laughs> as you do this, you look at her eyes and her eyes glow blue for a second and she shakes off her head. You... Yeah, you, not it. You're trying to change my mind? And as she oh. says this, Thorbjorn lifts up the glaive and points the glaive straight at her neck. And he goes, You will be quiet. And you will do as we say. The fate of your people <laughs> is at stake here. And I will not have you be a coward. I will not have you Turn your back on Ionia. I don't tolerate cowardice. Damn, boy. You stay with us. Thorbjorn, can you please roll an intimidation check? Yes, I can. <clears throat> All right. That's so great, though. Give me a second. I want to support him and just be like, that's what I wanted to show you. <laughs> yeah, go, Thorbjorn. <laughs> <laughs> no, but basically to help as well. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. We have your back. Just need you to move us. Why <laughs> <laughs> are you rolling oh, like Thorbjorn? God. I'm rolling like Thorbjorn. That is a... not here, but the asses is still here. That is a Thorbjorn roll, if oh, I've ever man. seen one. <clears throat> okay. Um. So... I'm helping. Can he, can he have a bandage? No. Um, as, uh, as, as he says this, Lady Zun goes, They're not even my people. And she ducks under the glaive and begins knocking on the stone gate and yelling out, Let us out! Let us out now! And as she does this, the gate begins to open. I'm gonna go close to Thorian and just put a hand on his shoulder. Alright. Try to calm him. I wanna move closer to Lady Zoom and just mean we mean no harm. Yeah, I wanna go as well. I don't wanna her to leave. Alright, she's she's just We're, waiting for I'm the gate to open. Go, but... Okay. Well, as, as the gate opens, straight up um, outside, there's Master Dai Huang again, uh, the head, the hair all tied up in this very, very tight, tight bun with a, a little bit of white streaking uh, going. Um, and she kind of like immediately senses the tension. And as you approach Lady Zun to say that, she goes, I am scared for my life. Please, I have... A lot to live for. We are someone I need. That. There's someone I need to find, and I can't risk being here. Just, please. Could Un we help you after? I don't want your help. I really oh. don't. I just want to be left alone right now. Thank you, then. And Can she you... begins what? moving. What? Yeah. What? Yeah. What? You need to rest. You're not going anywhere like that. No, I'm gonna open. rest here. Yeah, could you, in the morning at least, move us one more time? What part of I'm knocked As unconscious when I used the spell do you not understand? I am teleporting myself out of your neck next thing in the morning tomorrow, oh, okay. and I'm giving Brido the armor back. We'll find another solution. But if you teleport in the morning alone, won't you be, you know... She's going uh, to the Placidia. And safe? Depends on where I teleport to. And she begins walking off, and she she approaches uh, Master Dai Huang and goes, Can you please point me towards where you sleep? Um, I, sure, you just go to the next floor. Thank you. And she begins running up immediately, 
and passes through all of you as Master Dai Huang kind of just stares. What? What, what happened? <sighs> Too much. Yeah. Your guards start try to kill us. Yeah. Yeah. What? Long we story have to short, kill everyone because they just turned. She she pushes uh, through you and to look at the bodies. They're 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 here. They they're, they've been here. Grandmaster, and she begins scrambling towards the side uh, yeah, to try. Knows. She she is running towards where the grandmaster would have been, which is uh, at the center of the um, this floor where he was awaiting for you guys. And just as you guys step out into into this place, your mind goes blank for a sec second, and it hurts very much as you you see this flashing blue eye, a gigantic eye with a slit, sort of reptilian eye. And you just hear... Run, all you want! I see you! And just as that happens and you you come back into reality, you begin the, the, the ground begins to shake and the floor and, and the temple just vibrates at with this strange sound as you hear outside. The dragon is here. And immediate, immediately after um, you begin hearing this, you hear yelling outside. And you see Grandmaster and um, Grandmaster Zunan and Master Dai Huang looking down the stairs. Uh, I don't need to get out of here. Uh, should Darbion grab Lady Zunz? I think he's going to sleep kindly. As, as you say that, Torbjorn goes, I don't care about her anymore. Let's see what's the, what this is all about. And he begins running immediately down and just ignores everything and is now heading down the temple. Why is he fucking gag if he has the fucking uh, armor, so... I go check on Lady Zoon. Right. You yeah. climb up to check? Yeah, that's all done. You follow Torbjorn? Yeah. Yeah. Bryda, where are you going? Uh, I've... I'll go with Eclipse. Okay, both of you go to Lady Zoon, say Torbjorn, go, to, go outside. <laughs> All right, um, which one shall we handle first? Let's handle outside first, maybe. Uh, so as you keep up with Torbjorn, uh, you just see him push past everyone. He jumps over a few, uh, over over the stairs, um, just straight up beelining towards the outside. And as you both run, you kind of Naruto running with your cloak behind you, um, and, and you arrive outside and you look up, you just see the paranoia is in the space of 10, maybe 30 minutes since you have arrived here, 30, 30, 40 minutes since you have arrived here, has expanded miles and miles and is now at the cusp of the Shoujin Monastery. And from it, you see these gigantic meteors that crash onto the ground and some of them are coming to crash on the temple, but this strange green barrier protects it and holds still. And as Thorbjorn kind of goes outside and he finds a Master Lu Grun, who is outside as well, and he runs towards him. Do you, do you follow him? Uh, yeah, but are there shadows? Inside, where you are? Roll perception check. I, I don't like being just running. <laughs> Don't see I, anyone. I, yeah, sorry. I it, it, like was, 10 times. Uh, yeah, a few. Yeah, there you go. Um, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> you no, know, it's fine. It's fine. Uh, you you don't see anything. You just see that the monks are now all looking outside, and a lot of them are moving towards the uh, the the walls uh, in, in assuming like defensive positions. And um, Thorbjorn 
is runs towards Lugrun and he go he, he begins talking to him uh, and as you uh, finally join up uh, Thorbjorn looks back at you um, and he says for shadows I don't know if you understood that though what for shadows I to, yeah 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 okay, okay, okay. there's nothing um, so uh, as uh, as he turns back to you he says um, apparently the temple is under attack right now. There are creatures outside of the walls. You're right, Scott. I am just telling you what they have told me. Okay. Anyway, <laughs> I couldn't hear it? Okay, okay, cool. Anyway, the temple is protected by a barrier. We should be safe inside until whatever it is that is outside is killed. But the paranoia has moved, Said. I was thinking maybe we should... So, uh, try to get the Kinko Spear, and then just rush for the dragon. I believe you might be right. But I... Still, Said. What? Can Argath do anything? <laughs> no, no, it's useless. You see, yeah. I... In, in my experience... It's, it's useless. It's not really a demon, but... I too thought that my anger was not useful. But when I gave it a little bit of attention... Yeah, but it's yours, Argoth isn't mine. It's just chilling. Well, maybe you should give people a chance. There's not a people. Demons... I don't understand how demons work, but... No, if he is as he says he is, he kind of reminds me of you. So, maybe you can find understanding in that. We need all the help we can get now, Said. Even if we have to make sacrifices. What is the help that you're looking for now? I want Lady Zune to get us out of here. And if you can control her, if you can draw her to our side... We can try to control her, but she can't do anything without resting. Yes, but... It's her intention to leave tomorrow, in the morning. We have the whole night to try that. I can try one more, that's it. Also, when she wakes up, we can use her. I doubt it. If I failed already with her like that, in the morning it'll be worse. Well, I don't know if that's exactly true. Sure. We won't know we... if we don't try. Sure. Should we meet with the others though? Because I can't do anything here. I'm gonna stay. Okay. Fighting? If I have to. This is my home. And he begins walking back towards the wall. Mm, okay, I follow with the distance in case it's needed. Alright, so you're not meeting up with the others? Yeah, they will eventually will join me, I guess. So okay, join you, us. You uh, you uh, uh, you keep a distance. You see Torbjorn climb up uh, to the wall, and he is now sort of like looking down, and mm. he looks like he is waiting. Um, he looks like he is waiting to for something to happen. Uh, he's mm -hmm. just scouring and browsing the the walls as you see that the, these shadow meteors begin to crash down, and he is just Try waiting to, to hold. Joe, if uh, I'm right. guessing we are at the limit of the barrier. Yeah, the limit so of the, the barrier ends like, right at the wall. Yeah, so if there's like a crack or it's, I gotcha. don't know, if it feels like something is uh, fading, that will engage too. Okay. <clears throat> All right. So now that we've handled this situation, both of you are meeting up with Lady Zoon. Uh, you find her; she's moving very slowly. Uh, so as she's sort of like feeling the everything vibrate and move uh, and shake. She's just looking around in panic as everyone is sort of moving around her and the monks are exiting the dorms and, and moving and, and moving outside. She's just looking around and to see what is happening. What do you guys do? She's in the corridor? Yeah, she's uh, in the process of going towards the dorms, uh, but she is still in the corridor, yeah. We approach you want her. to do the honors, Bruno? Or should I? 
Let's go together, I guess. Um, no. Are you are you okay? She looks back. You really think I'm okay? Dude, I'm I'm really trying to help. I am not okay at all, no. I know. Then why are you asking? Because I'm because still worried. Because we care about you. Do you really? Yeah. Yes, we do. Well, I'm sorry, but I don't share that feeling. Not right now. You don't have to share why it. You, you just why have would to we accept come back it. for you? Because you need me. What a mess. <laughs> we all need each other. Oh. No, I don't need you. I really don't. Yeah, you do. Why? The temple's under attack. Do you think you'll survive? This temple is protected by a barrier that is thousands of years old. It is held for thousands of years. It's going to, he to hold for a thousand more. Well, the dragon that is causing this is probably way older and way more powerful than the temple. The dragon was beaten by monks from this temple. You're naive. I disagree. The dragon was beaten by monks from this temple. With the spears yeah. that aren't here right With now. With the spears that we need. The dragon is not going to attack here. Well, then if why you take is us out of here, here, maybe he won't. No, he won't attack the temple of the Shojin. He why? won't attack any He's temple. He's already attacking. Because it is not the Order of the Shadows' mission to kill Ionia or to kill Ionians. It's to destroy Noxus. It's to defend Ionia, but in a more aggressive way. I know that they dream of domination, but they still somehow remain true. And that's why when we were leaving, when I looked at the trails in the sky, there was extension towards Noxian territory here. The dragon is accumulating power to destroy what remains of the Noxian army here. And if you are too naive, like you call me, to want to kill what can literally get Ionia rid of one of its biggest curses, then that's your own problem. But I myself am in self-preservation mode right now, and I will continue being in that mode. Whether I panic, whether I stop, I will be in self-preservation mode. And if I die, it will be on my own terms. Not yours, not the dragons, not the orders. I will give you your armor in the morning. Now, I believe that if you truly care about this temple and you care about the people around here and you don't want collateral damage to be suffered because the dragon is looking for you, because you have the spears that are destined to seal it, then I suggest you get your asses out of this temple. And I suggest you go defend it right now. Because I am through with this. I'm not your puppet. I'll leave your armor on the ground here in the morning. And then I'll leave. And she heads opposite the monks towards the dormitory. I mean, there's not much we can do right now. Is that the bone? Either Said can try to manipulate her mind again, or I don't feel right it manipulating her. Won't listen. She has someone that she cares about, and yeah. I know that feeling. Do you think it would help to bring that up in a conversation? That lady seems pretty stuck to her, you know. I think we should find another solution that maybe this temple can give us. There's a lot of power inside and probably they Do you have think something. there's a way to teleport for, from this temple to another place? There might be. There might be some kind go. of scrolls or something it's not just the demons or the guy that were on the library that had 
a scroll. I can go check with Master if he knows anything about the, on the temple that could help us move fast. Yeah, something we we need to find something. I don't I don't think that lady is the solution. Not right now. I'm starting to get a bit annoyed by her, to be honest. I don't want to say it, but it's well, getting on yeah, my nerves. you get annoyed by everyone, so... Kind during of the night, yes, but during the day, it's pretty hard to get, a, <laughs> to get that effect. We know you're getting a bit messed up with the feelings of night and day. Well, she's messed up right now, to be honest. <laughs> but let's I go find the master enough with this. When I died, so... I feel her. Well, I feel her too, but still, permanent death is at stake and she wants to do something stupid, but it's up to her. Is it, though? The way she talked sounds like Dragon is doing something good and not just something bad. The dragon Look, can action control will boxes. always be good and or bad, like depending on the way you see them. So, it's her version of the story. I mean, and we gotta respect that. So, let's try to get a talk with someone with power here and to see if we can get any kind of help with the teleportation or yes, please. the movement. All right, where are you headed? Let's start moving. Uh, let's we start moving towards the, the lowers. Okay. Um, Lower part. As you move, uh, you see now ahead of you, like already down uh, at the first floor, Grandmaster Zunan is walking outside of the uh, of the temple, but Master Dai Huang uh, on Excuse me, on the second floor. She is still there, uh, and as you guys approach, uh, she stops you and she goes, All right, uh, I can't believe I'm doing this. I understand the urgency of the situation right now. There's four artifacts of our order in the room. Yeah. You can take whichever one you feel like would help you. Maybe more than one, I don't know. You would have to tell us what kind of help what would they we, give uh, us. Of course. And she heads towards the gate and does uh, her her magic again and the, the sounds of bells once again uh, pop up as the gate opens uh, in front of you. And as she goes through uh, through the room and through the uh, the uh, artifacts one by one, um, she she first approaches uh, the boots, and she says, "These boots were worn by a Shojin monk that was blessed with, well, Shojin's ability to fly. They grant its wearer flight." It might okay. not be for long, but you can fly up to about four hours with these. And okay. you're not super fast, but maybe one of you can use them. Then she moves uh, towards the, the ring. And as she does, this ring here was worn by, well, the Shojin monk who fought Dumra. It gives you resistance to its breath attack, resistance to damage yep. of the necrotic type. She moves to the staff, and she says, This staff was once worn by a great healer of the Shojin. He, he used it to, well, bring people back and, and cure their wounds. It is a staff of healing. Barbjorn, Born is here. He's asking for He's here? permission to come in. Yeah. All right. Let's get him on. Woo! 
All right, one second, chat. Let's get a uh, Thorbjorn in here. <laughs> okay, let me switch to our regular hello. setup. Hey, hello. Hello. the boy. Hello, 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 hello. I'm here. Hey. How are you? Hello. Onion did a great job. I even rolled like you. <laughs> <laughs> I did. I did. Um. I'm, I'm trying to work on the lighting. I it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Welcome. Welcome. We're glad to have you. Um, all right. So just so so that we can catch you up real quick on what's happening right now. Um, temple is under some sort of attack. The paranoia is now pretty close to the temple, but the temple has a barrier that is protecting it. So right now, Thorbjorn is at the gate seeing if anything is needed along with Sade. All right. Also, Lady Zune seems to have been throwing a temper tantrum and she is refusing to uh, teleport you guys on the next day. You, Thorbjorn, you, Thorbjorn, attempted to intimidate her uh, to uh, to te still teleport you. However, uh, you failed miserably because you rolled like you usually do. Um, okay. So she is pretty mad right now uh, because Seda even tried to modify her memory but sadly failed. Oh, shit. Um, hi. Yes. Uh, hi. And uh, right now, uh, you guys are split, so it's you and Seda who are at the okay. gate. And right now I'm handling Brighto and Eclipse who are at, in the artifact room as um, the uh, as Master da, uh, Dai Huang is uh, ex explaining them what the uh, items, the artifacts there do because she wants to uh, give them to you to help. All right, so as she was saying, uh, this is a, a staff of healing. So I'll tell you what the staff is uh, pretty much gives you the ability to do as she would uh, explain you to you. The staff has 10 charges. Um, you can cast cure wounds from this from the spell from the staff one charge per per spell level up to fourth level but you can cast cure wounds from the, the from the the staff you can cast lesser restoration for two charges and you can cast mass cure wounds for five charges so you have two casts of mass cure wounds uh, from the staff of healing two two of the, the mass cure wounds yes so it's okay. five because it's five charges each cast of mass cure wounds but this is uh, this uh, this have uh, slot on uh, itself. Yeah, it has ten or charges. It... Okay, ten charges, and mm. I can use two times one, two times two times lesser, two times mass, and ten times cure wounds. Exactly. And you can you or, can yeah. yeah you can increase the level on cure wounds you. if you increase the charges. You can look up uh, look up the fourth the item. level max. Yeah, fourth level max. Uh, okay. And then she approaches um, the other the amulet that you guys um, uh, had seen. And she goes, this was the amulet worn by the same monk that fought Doomraw. This amulet right here makes you hardier. Your mu muscles will grow. You'll be able to take more hit. It is an amulet of health. Your constitution score is 19 while you wear this amulet. It has no effect on you if your constitution is already 19 or higher without it. Oh, okay. Okay. Alright. So these are the artifacts that she has up. Can we take them all? Five. Roll a persuasion check. You better roll high, motherfucker. Uh, these are very important we... items. Yeah. I just want to um, look at the crystal. Try to um, give the, the, the stuff back mm -hmm. and just try to see if the crystal has any kind of connection to the stuff. Like if it would give itself to the stuff in some kind of um, fusion or something. I don't know. <laughs> All right. You hold up the crystal to the staff. Please roll an arcana check for me. Okay. Can deal with uh, Eclipse? Yes, I'm gonna deal uh -huh. with Eclipse's situation now. Uh -huh. uh, while you do that. She goes, oh, I can give you three of them. Three? It's a plus, it's a 20, by the way. I have two in precision in the day. Oh, you do? Yeah. That's true. She'll say, then, that changes things. She'll say, can you at least bring them back? Yes, I can. 
<laughs> yes. You can't die. <laughs> <laughs> she raises I'll try to a... bring them safely as possible. She raises her hands as the spheres that protect the items shatter, and she begins bringing them towards her and places them in front of you. And with you, as you put your crystal next to the staff, can't quite figure out if your staff would be able to absorb it. Okay. Do you have your bag of holding? Who had that bag? Exactly. Torbjorn. Um, he's at Torbjorn the, he's at the gates right now. <laughs> but, um... Are any uh, of these items um, required uh, attunement? Do yes. you know that? Yes. Uh, Amulet of Health requires attunement, the boots require attunement, the staff requires attunement, all of them require attunement. <laughs> okay. Every <laughs> OB. Yeah, that yeah, makes sense. It's a trade-off. Yeah. Yep. That's not for me, probably, but okay. Um. Yeah, she's she's kind you. of just holding them for. Will you take them then? Yeah, sure. Yeah. Sorry, <laughs> I'm sorry about. They that. are all useful. We all right. need as much help as we can. So you grab all the items, you've got the winged boots. Uh, oh yeah, Torbjorn doesn't know. Uh, Born. Uh, yep. One of the items uh, is a pair of winged boots that allow you to fly for up to four hours. It, it doesn't uh, let you fly very fast, but it, whoever is wearing the boots can fly. Um, and it does require attunement. Then the other one was a ring, a ring of necrotic resistance. Uh, then there was a staff of healing and an amulet of health, the constitution thing that you heard. Uh, but yeah, those are the items. Uh, that she gave you and then she goes well uh, we can probably hold right now grandmaster is going outside but we, maybe you should help we need we're going to need any kind of transportation or teleportation because lady zun is not okay with what just happened here uh, and we don't want to force her I don't think we need to force her. Yeah, see, that's... It's gonna be a problem, because the Shojin have always been more of a secluded order. We have never communicated this much as we have been. Thorbjorn is part of the first generation of monks that are allowed to leave the temple. We were used to just staying inside. Yeah. There's no connection to any other temple. Okay, I... Don't you have, perhaps, a scroll of teleportation somewhere stored? Alright. Since you guys... <laughs> since you guys are being so annoying about this... <laughs> I'm gonna roll for it, okay? I'm gonna okay. roll for it. <clears throat> so, the, the, what I'm going to do with this roll is... I'm gonna, I'm gonna yell it out loud. If I roll... <laughs> Above, if I roll above a 16 with her modifiers, um, we are going to ha probably have a scroll here. Okay? Okay. 16 with her modifiers. Now, for how much you guys have been annoying me, let's see... The influence that that has on her modifiers. All right. Here we go. Okay, I'm even gonna I'm gonna t I'm gonna show you guys. Look, there's there's the dragon dice and there's two dice that look like the same. So you can do right or left or dragon dice. Which one? Dragon. It's a dragon. Dragon. Yeah, a dragon. Dra dice. Dragon right. dice. Dragon dice. All right. Here we go. Come on. Fix it. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Hell fuck. no, dude. Wait, I'll show you with the camera. Hell fucking no. Oh, fuck you, <laughs> hell. Wait, let's see if we can see it. Oh, shit. Wait, 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 wait. It's a two. A two. <laughs> um, Wait up the stars, please. Wait up. I'm sorry, I couldn't see reroll. Ah, shut the fuck up. Oh, oh. Hello? We lost Sade. Oh, okay. We lost Sade, wait. Like 
Oh. Yeah, we lost stage, so you have to reroll. She didn't see. No. She rage quits. Oh, wait, she's back. She's back. Okay. Um, but yeah. Uh, now when she when she put you're now switched. You're saved right now, uh, Torbjorn. But when when she puts the camera on, uh, it's okay. Um, but yeah, yeah. Uh, that was the roll. Uh, currently, we do not have. Okay. Fuck's sake, let's, we do not have any scrolls in here. She says to you. Let's just fight them. Fight, 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 um, fight, fight, We fight. start moving down, probably. All right. Yeah. You've been moving down with all the items, running. Yeah. Um, yeah. At this point, uh, Torbjorn, as you are sitting at the, the gate at the top, uh, looking down, you see a bunch of like these uh, sort of dog humanoids um, that are like barking and hitting the gates and the barrier is just pushing them back they don't seem to really be doing any damage there's like about five of them or something uh, it's probably even something you alone could, could take out they seem very fragile you don't see anything like very big um and they look like yeah. scouts like um no they they're spot you you look at the paranoia and see that they're like falling down everywhere literally everywhere like 100 200 300 feet uh, away from you it's it seems to be an effect of the paranoia that is spawning these creatures um in front of you right now and they are targeting you guys i forgot to say you also got a vision thorbjorn um of a this reptilian blue eye flaring up in your mind uh which was doing a high said um that which was uh which was pretty much um telling you that he sees you and that um you can run all you want it was probably the dragon um so it, it seems like there is some sort of pursuit going on right now for you guys after what happened inside uh with those with those uh those assassins so as you are on top of the gate uh climbing up like really slowly grandmaster zunan uh comes up to you and he goes oh, oh, i'm too old for this too old mm. all right <clears throat> move out move out move out of the way he steps forward and as he sort of closes his eyes and grabs his staff uh, he then crosses his legs like mid-air and begins floating, uh, just grabbing the staff. Uh, and as he does, you see the sort of the, the barrier shines with this green key and it looks like like scales of a dragon are now envel enveloping uh, the temple as the, the barrier seems to be reinforced. And as he opens his eyes, the sort of shockwave moves forth and you see the creatures sort of cover uh, their eyes and they move back a little bit, but they still hold their ground looking at the temple. And he then rests his feet on the ground again. And he says, well, so apparently leaving the temple was a bad idea. I shouldn't have told you to do that. Just talking to you, Thorbjorn. Well, because you left and look what the fuck happened. W was I the only one that left? Well, not really, but is there anyone else holding the old spear of Shojin? <laughs> I'm just yeah. nodding in the back. Like... Well, um... Yeah. Yeah. Maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Well, did you get the javelin? Yes. Good. Now stick it up his ass. Will do. And he goes back to going down the stairs again, like very slowly, just as Eclipse and Brido begin creeping up uh, to join both Sade and Torbjorn at the walls. Oh, um, Master Zunan, um, is this barrier one way or two way? Huh? 
is this a one-way barrier like people from outside can get in or is it two-way no one can pass the barrier you can get out you think i'm stupid what i want to ask master zunan is if we shoot arrows from this side at the creatures do do they pass or do they shock against the barrier they'll pass through okay then i look at said would but why please... why would you do that they're infinitely coming in you're just wasting ammunition oh they don't free xp dude no, um... this is why thorbjorn <laughs> you should have gone to war studies but you didn't and look where you are <laughs> Vicky sorry has to leave. <laughs> I feel I feel a little bit attacked after that comment. I'm sorry. <laughs> Truth sometimes hurts, and so does my back. And he continues walking down the stairs now. As you guys join Satan Torger. Um, Can you open the bag? Yeah, we have this to use. For us. You stole it? Oh, no. <laughs> <Okay. laughs> That's the first fucking thing that comes to your mind? That you would stole it! If we came it's here and mind. you stayed behind. <laughs> okay, then, um... <laughs> fucking hell. He took then... a moment to steal it? Awesome. What I do wrong. is... Uh, Brido, do you have any necklace? Uh, no. Uh, Are you wearing? Oh, I have. A, an attunement do necklace. Do you have any any necklace? I don't, wear? but I have a necklace. You but you can you can <laughs> wear two necklaces. Uh, do I know you? you uh, Eclipse, you showed us uh, the the artifacts, right? Yeah. Yeah. So I was thinking, I would give the, um, I would give my necklace to Brido. The peri peri of uh, wound closure to Varito, so he stabilizes. I wear the Constitution necklace because it boosts my um, my armor class and my health. It only boosts your health. Your health, yeah. Um, it's just class. HP. For, for no, armor class comes from uh, dexterity. You guys explained what the things did, right? Yeah, yeah we did. Thank you. Okay, so. Um, you should also probably take the boots Because, you know, we need to throw spears You're probably yeah. the best to throw the fucking spear We, so, you we know, probably just can't it. stab the spear just throwing it It's not like darts Yeah, yeah have, but, you know, has, uh, Question, uh, have we asked anyone what's the weak spot of the dragon? No Normally, one has ever spoken of a weak spot of the dragon. Yeah, yeah okay. Like, uh, we could have... Uh, then... More, like, a to-do list. Ask weak <laughs> dragon's weak spots. He's I back, alright! I <laughs> love war. This fucking guy. I just remember, we, we don't know the weak spots of a I dragon. I think he has so one. No. That's the thing. Well, his you know, butthole is one. one. Let me say the <laughs> sure. spears are the weak spot. Let's... Yeah. That's no, because do. even if you try to stick a spear on a scale, it's gonna be harder than you, you, if you we'll, if we'll you stick have... it up like the belly. Stick it up gonna... on his open mouth. It's the best, you know. There's a or logic, you... but you know. Or you can stick it up his ass. <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> stick it up the ass. Even you mark. You mark. The the you right mark now. the spot. You mark the spot. I stick. Okay. Um. But okay, so what what are we doing now? Killing the bitches, we... leaving the place. We don't oh, have we to can't... leave this place. We can't leave because of your armor. We are going to sleep. Right on. And as soon as we get the armor, we leave. Wait, um, what? How, how are we gonna get the armor back? Yeah, Lady Zoon us... got messed with a head, and she said that if if no. She said that she won't go with us, and she will give her, my armor back. Oh! That happened. Quick point of thing. Also, Thorbjorn suggested to say that both of you try to do it again, modify her memory at the top of the morning before she leaves, 
Uh, or either Sade gets to control her so that she teleports you guys um, out. In full solution solve it or problem solving mode. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I don't think we should do that though. Okay, 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 okay. Okay. Up to you really. Oh but yeah. Again, she's her mind is too strong. So. Yeah, her mind yeah. Um I felt the way she talked when she said she had someone. I'm here and I'm I'm just thinking that I'm I'm happy for my father be on the other side far away from here I, w I would not be okay if he was in Ionia right now so hmm. I don't know about you but I kind of feel bad for her. I, I mean, I, I we just... walk to Kinko next because we don't need the four. Of course, it'd be great to get the four, but like if we're walking now, wait, do we get the? We didn't get this. Um, we have two spears. We have the Kinko... spear of the Shojin and the the spear of the shadows. Yeah, but that's the thing. We really, it would be great to have the paranoia one, the Kinko one, but Kinko is so far. So the the runner is, is the farthest as well. Yeah, but we don't know what the arana does. So the thing yeah, is, are we doing any? Are we going to try to get at least the kinku to reduce this? And I point to the paranoia, or do we just go for the dragon because we don't no longer have a TP? Uh, yeah, I don't think we, I don't think we have time for too much thinking. And Fine. Okay. for. Grabbing the spear seems um, like we're just giving more time for the paranoia to to spread away. Uh, who um, who had contact with uh, uh, a way to get in contact with Zed? It's Kane. Or Mr. Twitter DMs. Yeah. Oh yeah. Uh, we could ask him to get one of the spears. Oh no, he went to search we for Ionia. We tried. He said no. Oh. Zed is on his way to Ionia City right now. It's what he told he okay. would do. To, yeah. to scout out Ionia City for you. Shit. I mean, we can make the dragon unable to fly and we can make the dragon unable to spear fire. Spear fire. Which kind of makes uh, the ring useless if you do lock it no it depends the the ring does what uh, against since you is breath which to necro is necrotic yeah it's yeah. a ring of necrotic Resist resistance yeah. yeah i think against paranoia it would be good yeah against everything that comes from that dragon yeah if it's magical we'll yeah be sure protect equip it um i was thinking on if there was someone that needed to take it to this world and bring him with one mission. Probably only that person would be capable of bringing him back. That person is dead. But yes. we have the mask. We have Eclipse. We could try to... Fake it. <laughs> fake it, yeah. It's a long shot, but right now we need every shot. I don't, I don't, I don't think he controlled Umral. I think he only set him free. But I don't think he was well, even. He has the mission, so yeah, I don't think he. I, I don't think he had any control of Umral. Umral is doing what he was created to do. It was to bring destruction. Yeah, Lady Zun talked about that, and she seemed really convinced about him doing good for Ionia. Dumro? He just yeah. destroyed the whole island. Just... He's going towards Noxus. He's oh. probably... She said, I, I, I know nothing about Ion, Ionian history, but she said that Dumral is meant to 
extract Ionia from Noxus. I know this. You would not know. The the history of believe. the history of of Doomral is is very secluded from from Ionia. Um, yeah, from from what we know, Doomral was created as a mean has a, a, a way to have some sort of defense. Doomral was never really cre created. What happened was Doomral Sorry. was freed from the Shadow Realm, and it, he was supposed to be controlled. That's what uh, Master Daiwan told you. Uh, yeah. However, there was a mistake, and the person who summoned him could not uh, maintain control. control over Doomral. And so what they did was they sealed it back. Um, however, it, he is he is a creature of the Shadow Realm itself. He does not have a function associated with Ionia. He was being used as such. Yeah, so I believe he just he's he's just doing what he's meant to do. I don't think a hundred or three hundred years after someone is finally able to control him. I think they just let him free and he's running rampant. So I don't think appearing just because of a mask he's gonna reply to your commands. Well, then we get this pierced. I, yeah. I don't think we have time to get this pierced. I think the question here is only if you want to try that before we attack, kind of thing. Because I guess we are moving to towards the dragon. But the thing is, if we're going towards the dragon, then we can talk to with Lady Zooms. If she's going to, she, if she's going to the Placidium, she can take us with us so that we're closer to Ionian City. Thank you. Is it closer to the Ionian City? Yeah, it is. It is. Yeah. It is. I know. I mean, I just threatened her, so... Uh, whatever yeah. You guys are. I just tried I to mean, control her. Yeah, we... But if she's going there, you know? <laughs> yeah, if she's going but there, I she think, can take Yeah, but, but I think it's different teleporting herself and teleporting five people. She'll be exhausted True. either way, though. Yeah, she won't. She will be less exhausted if she is only teleporting herself. Yeah, and she she just teleported us and she couldn't give me my armor back. So if she teleports us again, she won't be able to give my armor back again. How, uh, so how, maybe far, she... how far are we from the, the Placidium? Uh, less than a week. Probably sorry, like... not the Placidium, Ionia, sorry. Oh, Ionia City. Uh, Ionia City, you're... A little over a week travel like a week and two three days maybe depends on the, on the pace you're traveling of course but I'm you're traveling the at a fast place you might get there in a week the dragon seems to be coming for us the paranoia yeah, seems, really. the yeah. problem the problem is that paranoia seems to be evolving like every time that it passes, paranoia spreads further and gets stronger. Now it's spawning. It's spawning these hell demons or or whatever this is. If we take any longer, imagine where it can start to spawn. Imagine, yeah. ima imagine that it spreads so much that the link between our world and the shadow world is unclosable. And we have to deal const constantly with this type of beast, so I think we should move fast and now take, I had, take down I had a dumb idea, but I think it's way too, too late for that, but Ionia could help if we somehow found the last... There was one, we were missing one or two. You are missing. Three? I'll, I'll, tell I you right so. I'll tell you right now. I'll tell you right now. We did two of them, I think. And there's I think there were more. One died. We killed two. Nobody was more things. It was one. Just yeah, one end. was one was killed. We killed two. We killed three. There are four alive. Yeah. There are four alive. Okay. Mm -hmm. That That's is what Argath told uh, Sage. 
There are still four of the Vasai Shire alive. I don't want to send the ping. Like, any ideas for fast teleportation? To who? Who else? Are oh, you talking to Argath? Yeah. Oh my. <laughs> it must be Christmas. <laughs> um, <laughs> Just like a quick. Just because he mentioned Ionia, and I'm sure he will be ears dropping. Mm -hmm. And uh, I just want to throw in any suggestions okay. for us to move faster. My Google is like, what the fuck do you want now? <laughs> Actually, yes, I do have oh. one. Okay. How about you poison that little bitch and let me? Do the work. <laughs> no, I kind of want to say yes. What happens when you poison? You know, her mind is weaker, more susceptible. Make her drink your poison, and we will win. Okay, I share with you the beginning. I don't know how to feel about a demon <laughs> controlling... Yeah, you threatened her and said that she would die if she wouldn't yeah. help us, so yeah. you're kind of... That was 10, min 10 minutes ten more? That was right? like more. 20 minutes ago! I've changed my saying. mind! I'm like a different person. Minutes. I'm a new, I'm a new guy. A new, a new me. <laughs> Demon can do something about her too, and here I am telling you what the demon can do, and you're like, mm, I'm not sure. Oh fuck! Come on, man. <laughs> um, hey, sure, Th fuck it, do it. Thorbjorn, this is Ionia. This is the lives of people you care about, and this is a decision you, the man with the incarnation of anger behind him, is it? It's a decision you have to make now. What do you think that a man that is now driven to fight? Do you think he would care about Lady Zun? Lady Zun also said she didn't care about Ionia because she yeah. was Ionia. Just fucking do it. Do it. <laughs> yeah. How the fuck do I give her water? I asked well, if she wants tea. I volunteer claw. myself as a tribute. Take a claw. You can go in the middle of the night <laughs> and just make her drink. Um, don't you have don't you have a certain cape that allows you to get in the shadows and do some pokey sleeping i'm sure we can just get in there so, no need for shadow I just go in there and the Argus. shadow would be a more guaranteed way but sure Argus needs to promise that he won't harm it's her it's a poison it's not he will, he, he will I've seen her. his job. Yeah. It's the point. We it's have not... seen his job. It's People just exploding. <laughs> out of nowhere. I ask, I, will you make her explode? Like brain. Why would I do that? I don't know, because you did the other. I didn't like the other person. Do you like this one? No, but I can uh. use powerful certain. Any, like promise stuff or I shouldn't believe because you're a demon what do you want me to promise say oh you tell me what to do with her you don't kill her um we get the armor yeah Look, he was what we need I am a demon in prison part mm. within mm. me mm. my interest mm. is to gather people People that believe my story, that believe me. It's not in my interest to kill my servants. Yes, guys. Listen, I don't have but... the relationship with her that I have with you. I would not give her power. You're special, see? Mm -hmm. Let's allow a millennial demon, a millennia demon, uh, take control of. A wizard capable yeah. of a the most... A millennial demon, dude? What's that, dude? A millennial... No, a, a mille, 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 you, think, you think Argath is just fucking sitting down watching Friends eating popcorn yeah. while he's uh, in Not millennial. Time? I wanted, like, an 
old ass fucking demon. Millennia? Millennia old? Yeah, maybe, yeah. Yeah. Right. yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, let's give him a fucking broken ass piece of shit. Sorcerer. Yeah, sorcerer and that has that has a bunch of fucking artifacts in its possession. I'm talking as a player, okay? But has a character, fucking let's do it. It's the fucking only way, I don't like yeah. it either. Because it's the poison. Is it only weakened or no, she, to she you, takes control to of you, it. To you, the poison is going to weaken her mind to you, whatever you want. Uh, the, it's it's written in the ability, whatever right. checks that she does against you are made at disadvantage. Be it saving throws or ability checks, anything made against you while poisoned by that is made at disadvantage. What about Argus? What about Argath? Let me see if the ability says anything no, about Argath. It Surprisingly, it doesn't. I wonder if it that is an Argath's not. character sheet and not yours. Uh, I have no idea, so you guys want to risk it? <laughs> sure, let's do it. <laughs> I'm not taking responsibility on this. I so um, this. I do this, <laughs> and then I ask her to teleport us in the morning. You ask, you command. Yeah, 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 but to Ionian City? Should I? Do it? How long does the command work? Uh, she can just dom. If if you're talking about dominate person, uh, yeah. Sade Sade can just use dominate person on on her, command her to do one action, one thing, and she does that thing, uh, and. Uh, the spell is concentration up to one minute. So after one minute, the person stops doing whatever Sade wants to, but within one minute, the person has to do whatever Sade tells her to do. What's the type What's the type of, uh, of, of the spell, by the way? What do you mean uh, type? It's, it's a wisdom what's save. The, it's a wisdom save. Mm. Does anyone have anything that is able to give her the wisdom no. disadvantage? Yes, Sade's poison. Yes, a, 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 aside from Sade's poison. Um, no. I have a so, question. I can only ask for one thing. Uh, you can ask for anything within the minute. Oh, okay. Then yeah, okay. Because that way, I could ask for the, the armor. Then that's the thing. But maybe okay. Because it lasts one person. It will be like tipping us and not her. So Ionia, see. Oh, she, does she need to come with us? No, she doesn't. she doesn't. For Ionia, she doesn't. Yeah. She How can many times here. can you do that in a day? What? Dominate, Nine. dominate person twice. Nine. Oh, no, yeah. the, the mine. Mine? The me modify memory. Modify memory twice. The long rest. I don't know. I could guess it too, but not sure what, what the point is after the day we've had. It's a lot of memories. Yeah. Say. Tell me. I'm gonna go out on a limb here. Mm. If you are willing mm. to release me, mm. I'll fight Thumra. I'm gonna release you. Well, I might have to sacrifice a few lives. Oh, cool. How many? In my current state, you poison ten people. That might be enough. So, um, this conversation, uh, Argas wants is offering to fight the, the dragon. If you guys want mm -hmm. it? Yeah, and then we have to fight. Uh, <laughs> then we have to fight Argas and not the dragon. <laughs> yeah, he I thinks he can enough. fight me. Ah, cute. I can f okay no. We, I, I, I didn't hear that. <laughs> no. Why would I even let you free? Like, sir. I will kill Tumra. Kill us all, son. I will not kill you, Sid. Oh, thank you. How to end the campaign in one episode. <laughs> I'm gonna go for a bit, be right back. <laughs> oh, um, God. Listen. If you can... I got speed run any percentage. 
if you can promise those things, you know, I think we, I can go ahead with the poisoning on Lady Zoon only. Say it, say it, say it. You are so reluctant in using power that is given to you. Uh, I wonder why. I won't kill her because I don't want to. But I will have you know that if I did... You can never, you know, kill me or control me and that's not... Look, say that mm. I, I am a demon. I do what I want to do. And exactly. I will always do what I want to do. And for now, I can guarantee you. I don't want to kill you. And I don't want to kill her. In fact, I want you to spread our word. To show people what I am. To help me recover. That's why I'm giving you power. Also because you freed the one... Yeah, you're welcome. That I care about. Great. Yeah. Well, yeah, that's why I'm keeping you alive, because otherwise, yeah. trust me, it would have ended a long time ago, because you and I are too much alike for this to be worth it. <laughs> um, yeah. either way, just do it. You don't need her, and what of her will, why does it matter? She's just a mortal. She will die in a few years, you will remain. So, what's the problem? Let her go. I turned to Ryder. Can you cure someone of that mind poison? No, he uh, has to be real good to do that. Mm. Probably. Yeah. And I don't know. Are we supposed to be fighting people outside? Are we cool? Uh, the, the monsters are just kind of waiting each one that hits the 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 barrier seems to like be pushed back by this this jolt of jade lightning and they're right. pushed back a few feet and and Just stay and wait if it makes sense for us to even be discussing this now or if we should try to kill some or if we like should try to go ahead with this and go to sleep or something like that or not Do you we guys need to fight you guys yeah. have not. You, you guys have not taken a long rest yet, so you don't have your spell slots from since last fight. Yeah. Yeah, that's Can't the question. Fight. Does it make sense for us to go to sleep while there's like a huge amount of guys outside? But that won't go away. For sure. That's the thing. There's more like sort of that pile up. A few, a few of them like. As they strike the barrier, instead of striking with, with their weapons, these sort of like skeletal shadow creatures, as they strike it with their claws, they, they are shattered out uh, and, and die instantly just for, from one strike to the barrier. Oh, did I? Oh, hold on. Yeah. No, um, my question is like, if we go to sleep, will they eventually pile up too much? Or We can ask a guard to warn us in that case, I guess. I'm still wondering. Um, what's Argath's plan? To modify her memory? To control her for well, one just, minute? He doesn't do anything. It's just the poison. Because of him, I can poison people and that makes them weaker to my commands. So basically what I tried to do before would be a little bit easier. But still doesn't say it will be guaranteed. But the plan is just poisoning her so I can try to control her to teleport us. How long does the poison effect stay? Forever. Oh, shit. Okay. Forever. If so, they're in combat yeah. and you try to poison them in combat, that changes. But if they're poisoned without being in combat, it's forever. So, you can just go there in the middle of the night. In the middle of the night. Oh, that's um, a question. Are we going to like sleep in the same? Uh, there, uh, Torgan, you would know this. There are dormitories here where uh, all of the monks sleep. It most you most likely would be sleeping in the dorm, which is where no, she. No, but is. like, yeah, exactly. We knew yeah, where we she should, went. So. We probably. I can will... find her with my projection. Yeah, I guess. You know where she all... was. You guys went after. I didn't went to her room. Yeah, we didn't know it's her exact room. I'm guessing it's, you know, 
So we are okay, guys. So we are gonna poison her. Okay, so let's just all take a long rest while Sade is up. She can go shadowy mode or how the hell she wants to do this. Stick a finger yeah. in her. Let me be alone doing this. Thank you. I, I stick go a... with Sade. No, I go with Sade. Fine, you can Jeez. go stick a thing a, a finger at Lady Zoon. It's then... gonna be water, not a. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, then you can stick a, f a finger on Lady Zoom's waters, and then, <laughs> and and then we can dominate and go fight this fucking ass dragon. <laughs> the thing is, I also need to rest. In a way, I don't really you, sure. I'll just. You can rest still and do it. Yeah, you can just yeah. do it. You can wake rest. up a little late afterwards. Just do it. Fine. You should all come with me then, because of the, I don't know how the control will work, so... We should just instantly... Just, you, you're not... You're not going you're not to control cast her the controlling. Now. You're We're just, just gonna poison, poison her. her. Just but so if you can she control leaves. her. But that's the thing, I need to control her right away. said she would away. leave in the morning, because she still has to give her the I... armor. The poison is permanent, so you she can technically won't... poison her at night, and then yeah. wait to control her in the morning. That's but what? she didn't say she was going to meet us in the morning. She will drop the fucking uh, armor on the floor and go away. So you need to be there to see her so I can control her so she can TP us. If we're not there, she's gonna go away even if, even if she's poisoned. Guys, focus! Then we take, take a rest. Turns, then know. we take a rest. <laughs> That's what I mean! You rest and all of you come with me. Sure, so let's do that. Her and control then her. let's all go to sleep now and... Do it's that before it's literally she goes away. like 11 in the morning. <laughs> yeah, let's fucking sleep in the middle of a fight. You, Tor you have been a, a, like up for like four or three hours, something like that. Tor Torbjorn just gets on the floor and starts. No, I'm joking. <laughs> so, you guys want to go and get some exercise done so you can get tired? Um, we can uh, take this moment like... to choose the know. items. Torbjorn, can you? Find me like someone who could actually bring something to Lady Zoom to bring her like a glass of water. For me. Her. You're actually going to do that? Because she's yes. gonna. Yes. He can change. Sure. He can change his form. He can change his oh. form. Yes. Hello. I can give him. I can give. I can give him my clothes and he'll <laughs> pass by. Him. Not anymore. We've revealed your art today. Yeah, looks cool. Oh. Like mm -hmm. Cool. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Right. Very oh, cool. Actually, I, I forgot to do something. Yeah. Um, I'm going with the whips to to the kitchen and. Okay. Yes. Let's get a piece of cake. So you and me, Bright, are we gonna spar for a bit? Darbian. Um. Me. You you said last time you said that you wanted to learn something from the monks. So. Um. I was interested on the healing part of the monks. I, oh. I really like the healing slap. To learn how to heal, you need to learn how to hurt. So that then you can heal. I can hurt Look, people. man, I just want to spar. I want to punch something. Um, <laughs> there's probably someone that would love to be banged. <laughs> You're looking at the guards, the guards are like... <laughs> I don't know. Uh, would you? Me? <laughs> yeah. Um. You want to train with the best monk in Ionia City that belongs... Yeah, he's with BDC and that... Yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll I, I would say it's best that I keep watch over the dangers. I can watch for you. I, I, I'm good at watching. It's the monk's <laughs> duty to Dude, watch yeah, over. I'll put, I'll put on his side doing the same pose. Like, I can, I, ha I even have the stuff that can give me some kind of patience. Well, you, you want to fight him, I know. Come on, show, show him what you can do. I know you probably can kick his ass. No. <laughs> Fuck. Okay. Well... Um, just do some push-ups or something, I don't know. 
<laughs> Before we leave, I wanna I wanna ask, um, should I try to control her while she's sleeping? Before Yeah, we just have been talking about this with the guards with the guards right next to us, right? Yep. Yeah. I was wondering when someone was gonna ask that. Thank you. We are far. We are far. I assume that from the it's start. It's not like we were going to kill her. Not <laughs> 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 yet. I don't have the dog bag! So maybe he has to like half of it. Um. <laughs> um. So uh, I'm gonna start by. Should um, I? Should I? Are you what? Should, should I try to control her before? The poison. No. Uh, that might wake her up. Yeah. Yeah, but the poison seems like water, right? When you poison the yeah, water. Yeah, it's just, yeah. yeah it's water. So water or Eclipse whatever. can just give her water. Yeah, if exactly. She's I was thirsty, just she will drink it. Can we talk, talk this on somewhere the... else? Kitchen. It's already talked. We don't need to talk more. Exactly. It's just take the water, wait for her to drink. If he drinks, good. If he sh doesn't drink, we shove the water in her mouth. The luck is. Great. What's the face of the guard? The guard is extremely uncomfortable right now and a little bit worried. <laughs> he's he's just like. Poison him too. <laughs> on him <laughs> are you you want you, yeah <laughs> okay you want to oh, use man. wait wait you want to use a deck save on a no it's a, a wisdom, wisdom save. a wisdom save on a monk he yeah. is the average monk okay it's a, still i've been rolling like shit no, you haven't. i better Whereas, roll i better roll like shit right now like that for dark, so i'm just gonna look at it natural 20. No, it is a six. He fails. There you oh, go. I'm gonna follow this whole conversation. And we are talking about either if we go oh. to sleep or if we are fighting the getting water guys outside or if we are just leaving. You know? And tell him and tell him to No details about demons or poisoning anyone or And tell tell him anymore. tell him that he feels the need to spar me. And yeah, sure. He wants to fight Tarvion a little bit just to test his. All right. Uh, that so was a conversation between him, Brido, and uh, Tarvion, and then the rest he heard of us was if we're going to the kitchen to eat something, or if we're going to fight, or if we're going to rest because we need to rest. Okay. As as you you do that, his his face goes from to. Then he looks at Tarvion. Why would I want to fight him? Can and I go like, well, I'll come fight him. I... No, I looked at him again. I, suddenly, I don't want to. <laughs> he continues <laughs> looking forward. Yeah. Thorbjorn looks disappointed. Severely disappointed. The kitchen. Why the fuck is the kitchen? Fucking <laughs> 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 hell. I've been asking a lot. Oh, man. <laughs> I've... I've... <laughs> So we can move. <laughs> I could be, I could, I could be so fucking mean right now. <laughs> that is the funniest thing. Know. Where the fuck is the kitchen? <laughs> I could be so fucking mean. I need to right go now. in there right now. Um, go in there. Okay. Listen, just listen to your <laughs> instincts. You're a woman, right? No, oh didn't my god! That. I didn't you say did that. Get... I, I did. I did. No. Okay, so you you can find it. You can find it pretty easily. It's yeah, it's open. I, I point, it's open I to point the her, monks. It's open to the I monks. Point to, yeah, I point her where where the kitchen. Is. Yeah. So, uh, you guys will have to go to. Uh, Wait, the is Lugan? Is Lug Lu, uh, Lugrin? Yeah. Lugrin still on the field on the yeah, floor? Yeah, he is. You listen to everything. <laughs> <laughs> no, I I go while she goes to the to the. Mm -hmm. While they're. While they're doing that, I'm gonna go to Master Lugran and ask if he wants to spar. He will say... No. I am sorry, Thorbjorn, but I must conserve my strength for whatever is that is happening right now. 
I hope you understand that. You should do the same. And he is just firmly sticking in the same place. Then shouldn't all the other monks stop training? They have. They are all uh, sort of like standing in lines looking at and facing uh, the gates. Oh, okay. Yeah. By the way, did we, in the moments we were talking up there, did we change any, did, did we see any difference in the numbers of creatures coming at the, coming at the barrier? Uh, or is it always the same? It, 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 it remains the same because a lot of them end up dying by attacking the barrier, but they continuously are being spawned around the, uh, around the, the place. Do I have the knowledge of what spell this is? The barrier? Yeah. Uh, it is a protective spell that the, the Shojin Temple has had for, or Shojin Monastery has had for thousands of years. This has been here when you first came, uh, and this is probably going to stand mm -hmm. for a lot more time. It is only activated when the temple is under attack uh, by magic, and it, and it is not ever failed, not to your knowledge. Um, but and, is it uh, is it forever sustained, or is it does it, it is, have? Uh, it, it is sustained on one person's life force. So I believe that it would be Master Zunan. Yes. Yeah. So, do I do I know that if the monsters keep if the the spawners keep attacking the barrier, does it drain his him faster? No. It drains him equally. He just needs to keep it up. Okay. Concentration. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> All right. To the kitchen. You guys we find. Yeah. You guys find uh, has, the... yeah. As we are going to the kitchen, I, I I turn to them and I say, um, also, I think we should deal with the dragon as soon as possible because this barrier uh -huh. that's that's protecting. The temple drains Master Zunan's life, and he's already old. So I don't know how oh, long the her. barrier. Why how long? We as literally soon as we get out of here. We are going for the dragon because we can't afford to go grab the other spears. Focus on it. Focus. And um. And Onion, do I know? How fast this creature seems? Do I seem faster? Than what? Than the creatures. Yeah. Way How faster. I wanted to see something if the creatures are coming for us or they're just attacking the place. Sure. Like, I want to go out the barrier, like, full sprinting, not want to fight any of them. Like full spreading and going around seeing if the creatures follow me and then go back in inside the barrier. And I wanted to ask them about that also before doing it. Are you doing it or not? This is the warehouse. Where are you going, Thorbjorn? I just want to see. <laughs> Well, I don't know what the fuck Torbjorn is doing. Um. Oh, dude, you ma you missed that part. Uh. <laughs> I did, yeah. What? <laughs> <laughs> what? No, nothing, nothing. Just rewatch the stream when what? <laughs> when you get off. Um, okay. Um, I was just thinking that maybe the most if if we know that. I want to see if the monsters are here for us or for, or for, or for it's just part. they're just spawning and attacking whatever is nearest. There's a probably a part of them that are here for us. So the sooner we get out of here, the sooner they can lower the barrier. Yeah, yeah. So let's poison the lady. They shouldn't lower the barrier. They should keep it. But At the expense. Of Master Zunan's life. Well, yeah. So I don't know, I don't know how it works. Yeah, I'm telling you, the barrier is up at the expense of Master Zunan's life force. 
while you're discussing, I grab a glass of water. Yeah, and well, I'm, 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 I'm assuming that we are going yeah, to the kitchen you're, while we you are arrive at the kitchen. Kitchen. you arrive at the kitchen. You on the third floor, same floor where where the the dorm is. You guys arrive there. You can grab a glass of water very easily. Yes. Um, what do you, do you? Oh, Sade's uh, currently loading. Okay. Um, but you grab, you managed to grab a, a glass of water. Are you uh, altering self? Is that it? Uh, yeah. Like, yeah do, that like, is 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 there okay. is there any monks nearby? Yes. Sade yeah. is saying, "I poison it. I poison it. Uh, I poison uh, it." All right, Sade sticks her finger in the water, and you see. Actually, it's her middle finger. She sticks her middle finger in the water, and you see from the tattoo. Uh, it begins glowing with this greenish uh, energy as it then spills into the water and the water turns dark and green for a moment and then whoosh, transparent again. Drop a bit of that water in the biscuit. All right, you drizzle a little bit of it on the biscuit? Yeah, and I grab one biscuit for myself as well. All right. Don't eat the wrong one now. I know. <laughs> Do you? Uh, no. I just so, grabbed it. I didn't put yeah, it on the tray. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. while they're doing I this, I, I turn to Brido. Should I see what the creatures, how the creatures react with me leaving the barrier? No. That's that's not a good idea at all. Hmm. Let's go away, and we'll have a perception of that. Can go around temple to see if it attracts them but don't go outside hmm okay so while they're doing that I'm gonna stand at the limit of the barrier I'll seeing, hold the um, seeing how the creatures the react. artifacts okay and so I'll you start about Gotcha. So you guys go back to towards the the. I mean, the I go. I don't know. They they can do whatever they want with ladies and. Yeah, they, yeah. Both I'm, of them go to the ladies and I'll stay yeah. with her. You stay with her. All right. So while Sade is uh, coming back, okay, there you go. She's back. While Sade, while Sade no. is, is, oh no, we can't hear it. But while Sade is fixing no. her stuff, let's handle that situation. So Thorbjorn and Brito, you uh, head on to the wall. So you ha you stand at the first gate, uh, or at the yeah. gate at, at the gate. What do you do from here? Uh, is the barrier like on the gate? Yeah, it falls right at the end of the wall. I want to go on top of the wall. Yeah. And then as I start walking, I want to see if the creatures follow, like congregate more on where I am or if it's it's the same. All right, as you... Because there are there are other uh, monks on top of there the are, wall. There right? are, yeah, they, okay, there so are. Yeah, there are other I as I move, do they follow my my movement or? You begin seeing uh, the eyes of all the creatures <laughs> look at you and begin moving to where you're moving, <laughs> and they approach the wall at the place you're in. <laughs> okay, so yeah, they are following us. And I go back to Brido, and I just say we need to get out of here as fast as we can. Yeah. I was thinking. I'm back. On... Oh! oh my Hello! God. Hello! How should we use the the items? Yes. And... I take I take off my periodic wound closure item and You're... I give it to Brido. I don't think. Yeah. I was thinking on leaving these amulets and I, I take the one with a with a mountain of yeah them. um I was thinking on giving this maybe to Eclipse because he has the the power to taunt the the creature this might help him stay alive and that's still useful on you yep. I'll be fine Mm. I was thinking on giving you the the boots to help you reach the dragon okay. or the spear. 
and maybe keeping I'm, I'm thinking on keeping Eclipse alive here is really important so giving him the resistance it's I was thinking on the ring and the amulet for Eclipse uh, the boots for you and I will try yeah. I will try to connect the stuff with the crystal I mean, if it doesn't work do, I will do give I... it do I have one of you. Uh, do I have paranoia resistance since I can look at it and anyone else can't? One thing one thing is not being affected to what causes you uh, to the effects that that trouble your mind. The other thing is is not being affected by its physical effects, which is the spawning of monsters, the crashing of giant meteors, and yeah. stuff like that. That's all paranoia. So I don't get to is... sit tuned to it. Just... Yeah. I would have. Get on with it. I'm. I'm just saying that I would have to get like Chill. on the face. <laughs> I would have to get on the face with the dragon, like face to face. Shouldn't the resistance be be on me? Since um, I have to get near him. I'm okay with that too. He's a he front line with the spears. The breath, so it will be for all of us. And if Eclipse gets the attention he will need every kind of traction because he's not as sturdy as you and me true yeah like if he taunt him, taunts him he's the one being attacked and you can throw the spear kind of thing so. yeah sure so, I wanna yeah. throw it because I'm scared the dragon will just pop and then suddenly it's in so, the other continent we, by so. the way said we we are yeah. at the um, at the walls and you yeah. and Eclipse are going to the to lake here. Uh yeah, uh so you need a minute with this not a minute, an hour, but sure. <laughs> and you get it. You need to yeah. attune to it. Sure. So I'll what's, give I'll give the, Thorbjorn to the, the boots. What's of the name the of the boots? I don't have the name yet. But you asked the end. It's winged Bobby boots. Boy. Winged boots? Yeah. yeah. Uh, excuse and... me, one second. It's, I noticed there there was a bug here mm -hmm. because I was looking I was looking at Sade's um, inventory and I, w I, w I wasn't seeing because I, I'm pretty sure that the sh the, the thing that she has um, also gives her resistance uh, somewhere. Which one? Yes. Oh, okay, but it's physical. The shadow mantle. I just refreshed it oh. and it's there now because it wasn't there. Uh, so that gives you resistance to, to physical damage, not uh, necrotic. Yeah, necrotic. That's, that's what I was looking at. All right. So while this all is happening, you two, you have the water. The water is poisoned, and you're heading towards... The biscuit is poisoned, too. The biscuit, yeah, the biscuit is poisoned is as well. Poisoned. And you're moving towards the dorm. Yeah. I want to cast Alter Self way before I reach the door. Okay. I'm just going to wait at the bottom. Like... Are you going to try to conceal yourself anywhere, or are you just going to cast it where you are? Me? Yeah. Can, Obviously. Can I suggest like, you cast it on the kitchen, please? Yeah, yeah. No, no, no. There's monks. There's monks there. When I'll just there's cast no it on monks. the bathroom. Yeah. Just, just, okay, you go to a play to a, cor a strange corner, and a, a saint kind of like extends her cloak and covers you, um, <laughs> like you're like you're changing clothes in the beach, and everyone's just no, covering you with towels. Um, and you alter self. What do you What do you look like? Or uh, like a servant, more. I would say a servant. Okay, like a, a monk that works monk around servant. in the kitchen. Yeah. yeah. All right. Gotcha. All right. You do. I will stay there, and I just like just tell him, like I don't know, the lady on the I forgot the name on the room. Uh, yeah, it's, was they worried and sent her. Yeah. Food for I'll her say the grandmaster. <laughs> yeah, to get some after she had to deal with yeah. this and everything. All right. Just throw in everything. So as you begin. Climbing up the the dorm uh, the dorm tower because it's a sort of a tower that is uh, that there are multiple floors um, to this tower that you know have multiple rooms uh, assorted to so you go uh, onto which floor first? Sorry, what's with the floors again? There's uh, um, there's multiple floors here with dorm rooms so places to for people to sleep. Which floor you start? This one. All right, you go out to the first floor. There are 
So you go in. Just one, six, there are six rooms in here. I can just knock on them all. You can, sure. Yeah, but I can't just knock on them all. Right, you knock on the first one? Yeah. Right? You knock up. I, I mean, you knock on the door. The um, door opens up. There's a woman monk kind of holding um, her robes. Sorry, not you. Yeah, sorry. Sorry to bother you. W what do you want? Uh, do you know or notice where a lady, uh, and I try to describe Lady Zoom, uh, was or went to sleep? Do you know her room? No? No. Well, I'm sorry to bother you. Alright. Thank you. And she... I'll knock <laughs> on the next one. Next one? No answer. No answer? No. I bang harder. She might be sleeping. A few moments pass. No answer. Oh, next one. Right, knock on the next one. A dude shows up at the door. Yeah? Um, hi. Uh, have you seen a lady? And I describe her again. Around here, do you perhaps know her room? I was asleep up until now. I literally woke up like five minutes ago. I have no idea what's going on. Okay. The temple is under attack, but yeah, sure, you can sleep again. Thank you for your information. Oh. And he poof, closes the door. Yeah. Next. <laughs> you, knock, Next. you knock on the other door. No answer. Again, harder. <laughs> no answer. Next one. No answer. Can I open them? You can try to. I want to. I want to see their unlocked. Is there someone there? Not that you see. Okay. Uh, how many a... rooms? Have I searched all of them? No, them? one missing. But you, you, as you open up, it's just a, a regular bed. It has like the, these green sheets um, or green covers with white sheets and everything's just scrambled. It seems like whoever was in here kind of left in a hurry and like everything's on the floor. Is there anything that was left behind that could lead to that being that person leaving being the lady? No. No? Okay. No. Then the next one. No answer. I open it. Locked. Okay. Can I go to the other can I go to the other two rooms where there was no answer try to open the door? One of them is locked. The other one Idiot. opens up. You see this a similar situation. I go to the next floor. Right, next floor. Same display. Three, three. Okay, knock on the mall. For the purposes of time here, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. not Please. on the second floor. <laughs> Third floor. There are okay, six yeah, floors. We're going. Okay, I go to a guard, a guard, mm -hmm. or someone around, and no one around. Ask. There must be someone on that temple. Maybe inside the rooms, yeah. But right now in the dorms, no. The temple has been under attack. You saw a lot of the monks exit out outside into the courtyard. Stay, stay, and ask her help to find the damn lady. <laughs> 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 Maybe we should Wait, go I can't... and ask him to astral potato. Yeah, either that. I love Please. this. Please. Probably faster. Yeah. Can you can you go? Um... Sure. Yeah, please. I go meet them. Okay, you find Brido and and Torbjorn with their experiment on the wall. <laughs> go ahead. Okay, um, Brido, quick thing. Can you find me where Lady Zune is? Cause it's like six floors and. Yeah, Eclipse is finding all the wrong doors, oh. so... Yeah, sure. Thank you. Uh, I was thinking about the items, and I already gave the boots to Thorbjorn. Um, yeah, yeah. I think you should keep the amulet and the ring, uh, Eclipse. 
Eclipse is not there. 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 Eclipse uh, and you arrive at the, the sort of the, the first, f not the first floor, mm -hmm. but the, the, where the stairs begin to, towards the dorms. Um, you can go ahead and cast us for projection if that's what you want. How many? Six. Room. Oh. Six floors. Six rooms. I, I, don't, I don't think I can get up there with I'm sure you'll the find projection. their essence magic stuff. Can't you do the same with the eyes? I don't think so. You tried, though. Nope. I tried. <laughs> you you turn on your true sight, and um, uh, what is the range on that? Um, I'm gonna check really fast. I actually thought it wouldn't be uh, 60 feet. So yeah, yeah, it's small. All right, so you uh, can see on the first you can see on the first floor the yeah. um, the two essences there on the first floor. That he found, that Eclipse found, and, and told you about. As in, the people that he talked to are yeah. the only ones yeah. there? Yeah, oh, okay. on the first floor, yeah. Okay, then I start going. I know, Bright, you can come along. Her. Just to double Already check. Here. Yeah, to make sure it's her. You climb, you climb up, you climb up, you climb up, you finally reach about on the fourth floor. You spot two floors up on the sixth, last room. A very, very strong uh, magical she essence. She fucking went to the last room. Right, I can't even confirm it's her. Oh. Uh, Before yeah, we. Sure, sure. Take someone else's room. Yeah, please. Um, She's giving us so much work, Adam. I'm gonna sit on the ground and I'll cross my legs to look like I'm. <laughs> doing some kind of meditate, yeah. Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna, I'll, I'll do as a snap. projection. Yeah, I'll do as do a projection. I, do I see like any barrier, or can I even see it with you seeing? Yeah, you can. You can see her. You you can, or you can see like this this strong magical essence. It, it it's yeah. just it's just the form like... of the person, and along with yeah, all okay, of the okay. the creatures of the plane, the ex mm -hmm. the extra planar creatures that you can see uh, from the planes that cross with your world. Can and I pet one? Oof. Your hand goes through. Um, so as you uh, cast your astral projection, two floors up, surely enough, you can see the presence of um, a, a very strong magical presence um, of this sort of bluish essence that is on the very last room to the right of the sixth floor. Could be can her. I get close. Sure, you can move. You can move yeah. there. All right, you move there. I'll, I'll... Do you I'll cross do it under her. Okay, and you up, come Just up so from I the. Just so I know, I'll be under the floor. Okay. Uh, so she doesn't feel my. Okay, it has the shape of a woman. Yes, and it's she's lying down on the bed. Yeah, it's probably her. Well. I'll snap back. To reality. To reality. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Up, there goes gravity. Yeah. <laughs> You're familiar with that one, aren't you? Uh, I am too. Oh. Um, so you snap back. Pretty sure it's her. Yeah, it's her. Uh, I think so. At least it's a woman. So and it's laying down. Can you like, I don't know, help him with like sneakiness, or something? Oh. Um, not really so. sneaky, cause he'll be locked, knocking on the doors, but it like not need looking to be sneaky, suspicious. Just need suspicious. To go there and do it. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, but to make sure he's more reliable. Sure, I can go there with him. Oh, no. That's not, no. That's not it. No? No, it's just but, if you can boost him somehow. Yeah, I would, be, I would have to be with him. Yeah, let him be alone. Good luck. Okay. Sixth floor, last room, on the right. All right. Thanks. When I'll, I go find I'll that tap him a guidance as he leaves. Sure. If it stays good. If not, it's okay. a minute. So, so you. I think we can climb till the six two and just be looking at the. You go there. Now. You go there. <laughs> the the sixth floor door is there. What do you do? 
I knock on her door. You knock on her door. A few moments pass, and, and you hear, Oh, what now? And the door opens, and you see... Carob Cells. I'm just kidding. You see Lady <laughs> Zoom. <laughs> <laughs> I, was, I was about I was about to say fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> you, see, you see Lady Zoon um looking at you. Yeah. Uh you must be Lady Zoon, if I am not uh, wrong. Yes, who is asking? Uh Grandmaster asked me to deliver you this because he uh, has come has come to his attention that you were really stressed out earlier today. It was just a bit of comfort. In water and one biscuit. <laughs> yes, we have not. We, <laughs> we, don't, we don't have a lot to spare in this time. And I died, no... and you're giving me water and a biscuit. <laughs> it's not about the water and the biscuits, it's about the intention. Does intention heal me? Well, it won't hurt you. <laughs> I get it! <clears throat> why... Why does the... The Grandmaster that... Make a deception check. Dude! Uh, is it night you have or the day? Guidance? It is morning. You still have morning. the guidance with you, so you can add 1d4 to it. Nice. Come on, dude. Well, please. <laughs> yes! Nice. And add the 1d4, please. Save the boy. Yeah, add the 1d4. We need it. Just use everything. Fools. Oh, Alright. Um, 24. Um. <laughs> She goes, no. they, they must have told him. Well, <laughs> sure, give it to me. Ah, uh, this is such I a wrong her. thing. Oh. Alright, she takes it, and she places it down. Thank you. And she's gonna close the door. And she closes the door. Okay. <laughs> she's not gonna take it. <laughs> she must. And as... You leave. <laughs> as you leave. As you leave her door. And begin walking down. She's mine. You hear in your head, say it. What do you mean? And that's where we're gonna end today's episode. <laughs> Drink it, yay! Well, at least she drank it, yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right, oh, Pog. <laughs> so much fucking time to get her water in a biscuit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Where's the fucking kitchen? <laughs> <laughs> Wanted to poison her, honestly. Oh, that was great. Good job, guys. No, was it's it? not. This is gonna bite us it in the wasn't. ass later. It will. Bite or sting? The biggest sting. Um, Both. This <laughs> is gonna. This is gonna cost us dearly in the future. Will it? It will. Let's see if it does or not. We're gonna have to wait and see. Um. So we'll kill her. The thing know. is, it will. It will have. It, You're it so will cute. Think you can kill her. She only died <laughs> once. Yeah, but not. Well. With bad influence. Uh, well. Either way. And uh, when she was ultra exhausted, so you know, a bit different. <clears throat> well, um, either way. Wait, someone, someone's echoing. Who is it? It's Aid. Is it me? Oh, sorry. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. Um, all right. So either way, that's gonna be today's episode. Uh, I would like to remind you guys that we're gonna be, there's probably gonna be a few weeks where we can't do it or where we might like find a strange uh, time to do it, but most likely we're gonna spend like a, uh, about like two, maybe three weeks uh, uh, without having Rune. Uh, however, Sorry, I, this <laughs> I, I, am, I am setting up another one shot, so that's probably going to happen. 
Uh, but uh, it seems that our heroes are now getting ready to face a certain dragon. Um, this is gonna be. And we're gonna die. It's gonna be an interesting fight. Um, and I wish you guys, you know, all the. I don't wish you luck. I wish you brains. Fuck you, and, dude. <laughs> um, and let's see if you guys can figure out uh, how to defeat my baby uh, that you released out into the world. Um, I love him very much. Uh, <sighs> he is my second favorite character after Von Goth now. Um, so, you know, I wish you good luck in, in your endeavors, but we're going to have to wait to see uh, when those happen. Uh, either way, we're going to be uploading this uh, this episode soon. You know, if you're watching it on YouTube, thank you. You're cute. Um, and if you're not, you're also cute because you're watching it here. Um, we appreciate your support. And just for, just for you know, just again, I'm just going to show Thorbjorn's rework uh, real fast uh, on stream so that you guys can look at this uh, this yeah. buff the man. Muscle. It's, it's, the pretty muscle. It's, it's pretty similar. See? <laughs> Yep, it's yeah, kind of sure. the same thing. Um, wait, more. Wait, 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 he's gonna do it. Oh, look, look at him doing the XQC with the headphones. How the fuck does he do this shit? Yeah, no, just no. All right, yeah. Kind of, okay, okay, we're getting closer. We're getting closer. It's like a few, a few hand. Fuck. Now How the fuck do you do this, Phil? Uh, <laughs> the hair is longer. That's the trick. Either way, while we are blessed by this uh, <laughs> this thing that's happening no. right now, um, thank you, thank you guys very much for all the support that you have given to Rune, and thank you for hanging out with us. Uh, big, big, big fight uh, for the fate of Ionia is coming right now. If you thought that any of what you've seen so far was hard or was important, uh, this one is probably ten times that. Um, no. uh, so I I want you guys to uh, be hyped and excited for it. Uh, it will be soon. Time will go by fast. And I would like to remind you that our friends here, all of them, have their social media, their Twitch channels that you can follow. Uh, if you scroll down below, you will find them both in the YouTube video description as well as here uh, on uh, my channel. You'll be able to find the links to every one of them. So you can keep up with us and talk to us up until then. Uh, aside from that, there's going to be an upload of another one shot uh, onto the YouTube channel as well. And there is going to be another one shot that we are going to play. And you'll be able to see some of the cast members there as well uh if you are interested in that so that's pretty poggies other than that thank you once again for your support thank you for watching and staying with us up until so late and it's time to roll out the angel slash intro <laughs> that you know every single time that works yep every single time there's without fail perfect um so yeah we will see you guys soon. Bye-bye, guys. Bye. Our, our intro, yeah.